I am at this steep decline right now. As you can see, I just wanted to check the hill hold feature. So for the hill hold feature to function, you need to be in the riding mode. In the park mode, it doesn't work. You need to lift the stand. And uh, the scooter is going back. I'll just hold the brake for three seconds. I need to go into the riding mode. So oh, already it activated because I started my scooter in the incline. So automatically it's activated with the hill hold. As you can see the hill hold feature is there. I'll just deactivate it by pressing the brakes. The scooter is going back. I'll just hold the brake. See, it's activated. I'm just leaving the hand so you can see it's holding. If I push it back, it will give some notification. The lower may be less effective. If I leave it, it goes back. So I think it holds for approximately 30 seconds and then it deactivates. Before it deactivates, uh, it, it will give you a notification warning here. We will wait for that. And also slowly it will disengage. It will not just disengage at once so your scooter goes back. It will slowly disengage. The scooter start to go slowly backwards and then it will disengage. So let's wait for that. So for it to disengage, you can actually accelerate or use the brakes as well. It will disengage automatically. Or you can move forward with your legs. Still waiting for it to deactivate. This is the hello fish activity. See? Deactivating hello in one. See, it slowly goes back. Yeah, now we completed the segregation. So I need to hold the brakes. So you can hold both the brakes or single brake. Both works. So hello and activated. So I release it, so it's holding well. This is how you use. If you want to disengage, you can accelerate, it disengages or you can use the brakes.